So here we are in the Los Angeles Basin, about 9,000 feet, coming over the mountains, and we're going to basically fly into the uh, uh, Chino Airport, which is right about here. At this point, we're at about 9,000 feet, headed in. As we can see on the sectional, we're right about here, looking this way, coming down from the mountains here, down into the LA Basin. Okay, here we can look at our airspace from this viewpoint. Here we can see our Class Bravo airspace, which starts out here high and continues on down. And this is where the uh, large uh, airliners are gonna be following to go into uh, LAX over to the right. We can also look at our Class Charlie airspace. Okay, here we can see our different uh, layers for our Class Charlie. We can see our upper layer here of Ontario. We can see our lower layer here. And we can see some of our Class Charlie uh, airspace in back here. And we can also look at our Class Delta airspace. Underneath, we can see here's our Class Delta here, and here's our Class Delta here. So our intent is to fly down here course, underneath our uh, class Bravo, uh, underneath our class Charlie here, once we get here, and around our class Delta. So let's go ahead and start our flight simulator and fly on in. Okay, so now we're in our flight simulator here. And of course, here you can see our, uh, our rate of descent here, our altitude our airspeed over here, and our throttle over here. This is a Google Flight Simulator, so it's pretty sensitive here. But you notice we've, we've got to descend on down here because we need to uh, get lower overall, okay? So we're in a nice descent. We need to descend enough to get over the, get over the top of these mountains right here, but we don't want to descend um, so we minimize our descent rate here. Let's give it just a little bit of throttle so we can make it over the top of the, uh, the mountains here. And you notice we've got our class Delta airspace over here. We've got our class Delta airspace over here. So we're descending on down. Nice controlled descent here. And if you notice what we're, what we're, we're coming here, we're just coming over the edge of the mountains here. We're descending. We need to descend down to, to a, around 6,000 feet to get underneath our airspace, our class, uh, Bravo airspace here, and we need to descend down to 2,500 feet here to be able to get under our Class Charlie airspace level here. So we've got that nice descent coming from where we started up here high in the mountains on down below 6,000 here, and then down below 2,500 to get underneath our Class Charlie airspace here. Okay, so here we're back in our flight simulator. We're, we've got a nice descent going here because, as you can see, we're at 6,000. We, we need to go ahead and uh, descend on down. We're, it looks like we're uh, low enough to get under our class Bravo airspace here. And we can see our class Delta over here and our class Delta over here. Now, We've decided not to go up and over our class Charlie here. We've decided to, to head in and go around our class Delta here. So we're descending on down. Got a nice descent going here. Because we know that we've got to get <clears throat> down below oh, 7,000 to get to be under our class Bravo here, which we are, and we've, we know that we've got to get down to 
2,500 to get under our class Charlie airspace here. So we got a nice descent going here. And we're going to head on around. And we're going to head to here. And after this point, we can turn and go around that because this is our class Delta airspace. Again, we can see our class Charlie airspace here that we plan on flying underneath. And the level of that is at 2,700. So we're going to shoot for 2,500. So we're going to continue a nice gradual descent here. So as we come down, we're just going to give it just a little bit of throttle down here, which we've done to decrease our descent rate. Give it a little more throttle here. And we've got our corner of our class D airspace here that we need to get around. We're almost getting around that. And we can see we're underneath our class Charlie airspace here, at uh, which is at 2,700. Of course, you want to be setting your altimeter, talking to the tower, listening to the AWOS to make sure your altimeter is set properly. We're just getting around our class Delta airspace here. And here we go. So now we're just passing that class Delta airspace. So now we need to <clears throat> plan our uh, uh, attack coming in here for our landing at Chino Airport. And yeah, we'll more or less maintain our altitude here. Of course, we can see our class Charlie airspace here that we're just about going on, getting ready to go under here. And now you can see we're just going under our class Charlie airspace here. There we go. So now we're right underneath our upper layer of class Charlie airspace. And we can see our class Delta airspace here for our Chino Airport. And we're just about getting ready to enter that class airspace, our class Delta for the Chino Airport. Yeah, we know that airport out, is out here somewhere underneath the... And, of course, we're talking to the tower here to uh, make sure they know we're coming in and get permission to enter the airspace here. So we've accomplished that. And we're just about getting ready to hit into that class Delta airspace for the Chino Airport. Okay, so we've made our way <clears throat> down through. We've descended. And now we're down to 2,500 feet so we can get under the layer of this class Charlie airspace for the uh, Ontario Airport here. You can see that... Uh, uh, the top of this 5,000, 2,700. So we, we're at 2,500. And so now we're coming on in to our class Delta airspace here for our landing at the Chino Airport.
Okay, so here we've been cleared for long final on eight left, and we can see the airport ahead. So we're gonna we'll set up, and we're within class Delta airspace. And we'll go ahead and head in for landing. And there we go. There's your complex airspace flying.